Alright, here we go with the end game for the servants. A distasteful exercise in gaming. I've played XCOM since the beginning, UFO Defense in 1994, and all the games since. But here, I'm playing the servants. Somebody asked for the end game of it in the cutscene, so here it is. So you have to first uh, go through the main quest line to the point where you uh, are able to communicate with the aliens, find out what they want, gain their trust, and eventually you will get to uh, this last quest, Assert Alien Homogeny. And you have to, once you get this quest, you will get three different organizations. Uh, you have to have the one Sword of the Devoted on one of your uh, agents and you have to go to New York City to the UN once all the uh, requirements are met and uh, you herald the masters and they take over the planet. Uh, to do that first you have to control at least 65 percent of Earth's population. That's a difficult stretch. The other one was spacecraft having 80 percent. Uh, the aliens spacecraft account for that so I didn't have to make that many ships and didn't really have a lot of space combat uh, it's basically on the planet now to get this 65 percent out of 8 billion 404 million people you have to get a good chunk of the states on the map um, I had to get the EU Russia and all the little friends around them you have to you know join them to your main countries China India Indonesia I grabbed all these together into one uh, organization US Mexico Brazil those are all the ones that have the most of the population all these other places are really small it would take forever to do anything with those so it's basically the northern hemisphere India Indonesia and Brazil and once I did that they give you when you get this last quest they give you three different organizations one of them is called the Sword of the Voted it's this one here it allows you to finish the last quest of the game and abductions in order to, con to take control of different countries for the aliens you have to take control of each country and then build an uh, alien base in that country. So you have to get 15 uh, of these abduction missions. And there's only two of these orgs of the three that will allow you to do abduction missions. Uh, let's see. So it's right here. Uh, like Beijing for China I had to get 15 and then you're allowed to make the actual um, alien base like uh, for the US here's an alien structure I had to do that when I took over the US I had to do it for EU China India and so on and the person who has that sort of the devoted no nope, they just do abduction missions there uh, this guy's got one alien administration transition team that one okay this is the one once you've got 15 um, abduction missions in one province doesn't have to be the capital just somewhere in the country then you can build the facility after that and grant alien control the next turn and you can do abductions with this one so really it's that one and the one that ends the game where you uh, see the one no it's this guy so anyway I did that I got 65% and then you go to New York with this guy who has the correct organization 
and here's the button herald our masters f65 percent have the most fleet uh, sisters and brothers we have achieved harmony drowning out the unbelievers with one voice we find ourselves renewed refocused and reborn some will resist the dawning age of nirvana but in the end all will embrace salvation So, victory for the servants. Wrapping up here. And here's the information in a box. Well, they don't really show the aliens very infrequently. And then you get the credits. Aliens win. Game over, man. Game over.